And we're back. Yeah, it went much better once I realized that no, you are not on a time limit, and no, the mercenaries are not infinite. This means we're in much better shape now. But, can you blame me? I really thought that the deadly gas was a bit more deadly. I really expected it to be deadly neurotoxin. Could we focus on that group that's coming down the stairs barreling towards us right now? We very much appreciate that. Yes, I think we'll win this time! And she's down! Come on! I, I must say, I love the music right here! Yes! Time to tell the Arash shot how he was right and wrong. Huh. Ooh. Well, that is good. Is it worth it? I don't think I have to think about it. Well, at least the place can be cleansed of poison now. Bro, takes some time, but. Wait, what's the exit again? Oh, it's <laughs> I can't open that. <laughs> I feel silly now. It's what I'm here for. <sighs> well, let's go visit Big Dark and see what he has to say about this. Interesting. So, I was wrong about our thief. Yep. You'll get used to it. They say we were careless with our trap, that this is our fault. But even without the Sarkamek, there would have been death. This elf was determined to lay blame at our feet. I admire conviction with a focus. But your kind are truly committed to weakness. That weak elf made a good effort at using your own weapon against you. We have but one weapon. The certainty of the Kuhn. It cannot be used against us. And it doesn't matter. I am not here to fight. I am here to satisfy a demand you cannot understand. It's taking long enough. It will take as long as needed. No ship is coming. There is no rescue from duty to the Kuhn. I am stuck here. You could have built a ship by now, you know. <laughs> it is not about a ship. Filth stole from us. Not now, not the Sarkamek. Years ago. A simple act of greed has bound me. We are all denied Parvolin until I alone recover what was lost under my command. Huh. That is why this elf and her shadows are unimportant. That is why I do not simply walk from this pustule of a city. Fixing your mess is not the demand of the Kune, and you should all be grateful! Uh, big talk. Take a deep breath, man. You need a vacation. Does the cure not allow vacations? Thank you, human, for your service. Leave. On the edge. The Viscount should know. Eh. 
But at least we can explain to him that, as far as I understood, they're here because, well, not because of the weight from the ships, but because something was stolen from them and they're searching for it in the city. Or somewhere around here. Well, I'm not sure he will be happy to hear that, but at least he will know that they're not here to kidnap us. Or, you know, to kill us horribly, that is. Wait a moment, Shamus? Hi! Seamus, wasn't it? The Viscount's boy. I saved you! You're here rather often, Sir Arhawk. A good influence, I think. <laughs> Thank you. You started something, helping me as you did. I still accept no blame for defending Kunari, and I don't miss the kinship of the people who oppose what I believe. I have... I... I admire the Canary on some points, and the idea of having a certain goal is alluring, but the fact is they often don't want or deny the fact that other points of view could be right is annoying. Uh, I keep myself near the shock asked for me. I think they're a headache, but so are many people. And you've already treated them with more grace than most. Mere existence should not be an offense, no matter how they challenge the chantry. Agreed. Not when some of their ideas are so compelling. It's a, it's a good idea to keep an open mind, but one should be mindful that it doesn't fall out. And over there's Toady. Thank you. It's the ropes, isn't it? Hello. Years of nice, quiet anxiety. Gone. <laughs> Along with a whole street. An accident on purpose, more or less. Right. A mad elf, pushed by zealots, likely hidden in the very groups I have to appease. The Maker has a grand sense of humor. And the Arishok. I suspected he had no plans to leave. I didn't know it was just as annoying for him. Keep the worst of them off his back, and it'll be all right. But that is the problem. It has already escalated, despite your efforts. Shame. Do I want to hear what happened? A Konari delegate and entourage paid me a visit. It was civil, tentative, hopeful. They left my chambers with precision, but were not reported by the outer guard. They are missing almost literally from my doorstep. What do you imagine will be the Arishok's reaction? Do the Konari generally keep you updated? Konari do not disappear. They know we watch, and they are not shy about their movement. Speak to Seneschal Brown. He has details that show how damning this is. I don't know who would benefit from fighting the Konari, but it will cost all of us. <sighs> I am going to have to kill more people, don't I? Oh well, I'm good at that. And sometimes it's really cathartic. You hey, Toadie! information about the missing Konari. I am to help you, yes. Viscount Dumas would appreciate discretion in this matter. I would prefer that you were not involved at all. But that is neither here nor there. I'm having a hard time picturing the abduction of a Kunari entourage. Unfortunately, they were not at their best. Their swords were tied into their sheaths. As I advised. It seemed a respectful compromise. Even I know you cannot separate a Kunari from his weapon. Has anyone reported this to the Kunari? Maker, no. I'd be signing the messenger's death warrant. He'll find out soon enough, of course. And when he does, the Viscount is rightly concerned that the illusion of peace will dissolve. The Arishok is growing violent. He might want an excuse to end this peace. I don't believe that, but I have to ask. If the Arishok wanted to take over, he simply would. Yeah. For all we fear that heretical cune of his, its demands have done more to keep him in check than any of our efforts. Besides, would Kunari stoop to trickery? There is no precedent. But there is unfortunate evidence of influence on our side. It sounds like you don't want them found. I must think of what is best for the Viscount's office. Bringing attention to such an incident benefits no one. You would do nothing. The Kunari are neutral hostiles at best. There is no relationship to salvage by overextending ourselves on their behalf. So where would you start? 
If you were the starting type. I would begin with the most obvious failure. It's clear the city guard has no excuse for allowing this, unless they were involved. Not coincidentally, a number of recent recruits have failed to report. You should start with one of them. Although where you find a swordsman so eager to sell his honor and duty, I'm sure I don't know. A hanged man. Hanged man. Obvious one, that. <laughs> right. Then you know what to look for. I can't imagine this has occurred without notice. There is always a weak link. I wonder if you're involved somehow. The Viscount is under enough scrutiny as it is. Yeah, you can stop croaking now. Hmm, I'm curious. And now my companions want to talk to me. I'm so curious about this, I have to investigate! I can't let this lie! But since there's a city gun vault, I'll take you with me. Yes. I can't let this lie, I have to investigate this! I'm so excited! I can't restrain myself. So, maybe I should come back by... Night was? Wait. Yeah, at night. But while I'm here, Isabella. I have something for you. Ooh, what's this? Oh, isn't that just the cutest thing? Baby animals are cute. Ships, not so much. Thank you, Hawk. This was a thoughtful gesture. No problem. Okay, night. Haven't moved an inch, have you, Isabella? A lot of coin for this place. That's right, pal. Tonight I'm paid and blessed. And all I had to do was turn my head. Your captain's right behind you. To all my friends. Hey, step back. I know important people. We're going to show this city what to do with heed and oxman. Um, <coughs> uh, guy. I want to introduce you to someone. Your boss. Guard Captain, would you like to have a word with your man? <laughs> <laughs> Who? <laughs> what? Who? Who what? I don't... Who bought you? Who bought the honor of a proud guard of Kirkwall and made him a drunken Mabari ah, bitch? Bringing her along was a good idea. I don't know. He was a Templar. I swear. He had the seal of the Grand Cleric and everything. It's true. The penalty for abandoning your post is ten days on the wall. I expect you to report in the morning. Uh-huh. Hmm. Yeah, I have important friends too, as you noticed. There's your answer. A Templar. With the Grand Cleric seal, no less. Well done. I wonder if that's girl from the start. Oh, this is... this ought to be rich. This... this, this is going to be real good. This is going to be so good. One way or the other. <laughs> 